Welcome to my channel. In this video, I will show you the global version, the original, brand new top, selling nail lamp product on Amazon and AliExpress with discount price. Check discount price and buy from description below link. We must admit to wondering how Adafruit's Becky Stern gets anything done with those fingernails of hers. They're always long and beautifully painted without any chips, dings, or dents. As it turns out, she uses UV gel nail polish. It's much more durable than standard air dry polishes, but it requires UV light to cure. Becky bought a lamp to use at home, but it's very bulky and must be plugged into the wall. She knew there was a better way and devised her DUV mini manicure lamp. She really thought of everything. The open source 3D printed enclosure includes a small compartment in the top for cuticle sticks, emery boards, and tweezers. The Lee Poly battery is rechargeable over USB in conjunction with Adafruit's PowerBoost 500C. The lamp itself is made from 30 UV LEDs and 100 resistors. Becky lined the inside of hers with silver sticky paper to help distribute the UV light evenly. Why oh you know, this can also be used to erase eprams or to cure small DLP 3D prints. Do you have another use for it? Tell us in the comments. Introductory and partially hyperlapsed video after the break. Odds are I'm wearing one of two manicures. Fun, colorful gel extension usually with some kind of French detailing, or natural, glossy, bare nails. Sometimes I keep my nails short and simple for utilitarian purposes, like when I was performing facials in esthetician school. But more often than not, short nails mean that I've had the recent and impulsive urge to abandon my extravagant extensions and embrace a more minimalist approach to beauty. This might sound strange, but sometimes I just don't want my nails to be a thing. Another accessory I need to upkeep, spend money on, and think about when I'm getting dressed. But the transition from my long, elegant, decorated nails to short little nubs can be jarring, especially when my naked nails are looking a little tired and worn out from weeks of supporting extensions. But nothing, and I mean nothing, breathed instant life into my cracked and brittle nails, quite like Dior Nail Glow. I learned about the polish years ago from a friend who occasionally works as another accessory I need to upkeep, spend money on, and think about when I'm getting dressed. But the transition from my long, elegant, decorated nails to short little nubs can be jarring, especially when my naked nails are looking a little tired and worn out from weeks of supporting extensions. But nothing, and I mean nothing, breathed instant life into my cracked and brittle nails, quite like Dior Nail Glow. I learned about the polish years ago from a friend who occasionally works as a hand model for jewelry brands. Needless to say, my friend's nails always looked immaculate super shiny, meticulously filed, and healthy, and when I asked if she took any supplements or did any special treatments to maintain them, she shook her head and shared that Dior Nail Glow was her secret. There's no denying that the chic, Sleek packaging adorned with a Dior logo adds a certain level of luxury to the application experience. But that aside, the polish itself is something to behold. It's a glossy top coat with a blush hue that, when applied to the nail, has this remarkable brightening effect that just makes your nails look radiant and healthy. Over the years, I've tried countless sheer pinks, nudes, and glossy top coats in an attempt to find an alternative, but there's something about the specific, reflective bluish tone in Nail Glow's pink tint that cancels out yellowness in the nails and leaves them looking particularly vibrant. I'd be remiss not to mention that there are, however, some significant cons to falling in love with Dior's nail glow. For starters, the polish is $30 a bottle and the bottles are teeny tiny. And if that doesn't put you off, this just might. Dior just reformulated nail glow in the past few months and the reviews have been pretty lackluster. It sounds as though the new formula doesn't have the same exact pink hue. It's a bit subdued, and it tends to chip more quickly. I am light of the reformulation. I'd been keeping my eyes peeled for an alternative. It hadn't been going well until a few weeks ago when I had lunch with a friend who showed up with nails that had that sheer pinky purple hue that I had long been coveting. It was a Dior nail glow, though she confessed that she was also obsessed with Dior's original formula, but a strengthening polish from the brand Butter London, which she had originally purchased to treat her brittle nails but it's since fallen in love with its beautiful sheer tint. And to make things even better, this polish was only $18, which is nearly half the price of Nail Glow. These choices may be out of date. All of these products may not be in stores. We don't know when this will be back in stock. You need to go top Nail Lamp 2023 review link to see the most recent updates to the list. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to this channel.